Hey guys, so today I'm doing a phone case collection video. I didn't think I would be ordering so many cases for this phone just because I didn't think there were any cute ones and none of the ones that I have today are really that cute, but I'm sure in a month or two there'll be a part two because I just ordered a couple of rubber cases that I'm excited to receive in the mail. So this is my first one that I have on my phone right now and it's a purple liquid or quicksand glitter case. And um, probably within the first two days, this bubble appeared, and I hate, hate, hate bubbles in the liquid cases. Like, it's leaking somehow, but my phone's not wet. It's just this big mystery. Um, yeah, and I really like this case. I think I got all these cases from AliExpress. I think one is from eBay, and I will leave links for all of them down below so you guys can order them for yourselves. And yeah, it is from my Galaxy S7 Edge. If you didn't know, that is the phone that I have. So the very first case that I ordered, and I have the titanium or platinum, whatever color they're calling this. This is the first case I ordered just because I wasn't sure if I was getting the Edge. It's just like a clear rubber, and it's really, really, really nice. I actually ordered a second one because I figured... Oop. figured that I could do some kind of DIY with this case and it's just easy to put on your phone it's easy to take off and my phone is a lot easier to hold with this rubber case on so I really like the basic stuff I have a couple of mirrored cases this one is really unique because it's kind of that same rubber material as the other one except it's a little bit stronger this is in like rose gold and it's in certain angles it's just a straight up mirror I like this one because it's a like rubber so it slips on and off real easily but it's still mirrored I don't it's pretty weird yeah and this one doesn't track fingerprint doesn't look like it but this one doesn't hold fingerprints um, too bad like the next case that I'm gonna show you so this case is kind of a pain it's more sturdy um, and it's the just a plain regular silver mirror but with this one you have to Take this back piece off, pop your oh, Jesus Christ. phone in this way, and then you slide this back in. It's very annoying. There we go. And you seal it closed that way, and then it's, it's really like stuck on your phone and um, I don't know, I just think it's such a pain, and I, I'm not really liking these mirrored cases just because your fingerprints stick on them, and I wish the Samsung logo wasn't open, like, I don't, I don't really care that people know I have a Samsung or not, like, why would you do that? Other than that, I love that the buttons are covered, and it does feel like a good quality case, and I think it was only like $5, so I definitely recommend this if you're into these mirrored cases. Okay, so the next case is my Rainbow Six Ash case, and I ordered, this is a custom case from AliExpress, I think I mentioned it in my What's in My Phone video, I will link that video down below, of course, but it's just a basic, like, nothing case, the buttons aren't even covered, and it's very thin, flimsy plastic, but you're really, uh, just aiming for your custom image that's on your case, and I got the matte finish, I believe you could get a gloss finish uh, also but I don't know what that looks like um I don't think I ordered another one of these I'm not too sure but I really I'm so in love with this one the other rubber case I forgot to show it's this clear blue one I think this comes in other colors but the interesting thing about this is it has a come on it has like a front part and a back part it's it's very odd and it's Kind of weird to put on your phone but let's see if I can yeah you have a total condom on your phone basically <laughs> it's really cool um I kind of I kind of like that the front was covered and uh, the fingerprint works well and the screen is perfectly fine I actually really like this it's just the case is way way too plain if I work out a DIY maybe I could do a DIY with this and then it could be glittery or something um, but yeah, all in all, this is a good case. I have two more cases. Next is this blue, oh, hair. I think they called it a honeycomb, because it has all these, like, dots. I would think it was like a, um, like a golf ball. Yeah, and I just got this blue. It does come in other colors. 
Uh, just the cheap, the buttons are covered and it's a nice rubber material. I just wish it was a little chunkier, a little thicker because I do like my phones to be nice and fat, you know. And finally, my first beautiful case. This is the one that I got from eBay just because it wasn't available on AliExpress because the phone had just came out when I ordered it. But um, the buttons are open. As you can see, they're kind of... Um, this case... Oh, can we close? And this case is really beautiful. And again, it's only like 4 or $5 and there are different colors. It's just rhinestones. And these huge jewels, obviously. And even came with a glue. Like they're telling you that you know, these things are gonna pop off at some point, so here's some glue to put them back on. <laughs> but these rhinestones just get caught in my purse and on my clothes, so I just don't really... I don't know, I loved this case when I had it, but I'm, I'm not really gonna wear it because I don't want to ruin the case. It's more of a special occasion case. Oh, and I also wanted to quickly mention that the wireless charging does work on all of these cases that I showed you, even uh, this chunky rhinestone one from eBay get you a nice thumbnail picture here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. Bye!